Former Premier Najib Abdul Razak has withdrawn his wrongful prosecution suit against the government. This leaves former Attorney General Tommy Thomas as the sole defendant in the suit over his alleged wrongful prosecution for several criminal cases. According to a copy of the notice of discontinuance filed yesterday by his lawyers, Najib has withdrawn the lawsuit against the government without costs. No reasons were given in the notice of discontinuance. Najib's legal team had filed a lawsuit against Thomas and the government on October 22 last year. He stated that Thomas had committed misfeasance in public office, malicious process and negligence. Najib stated that Thomas's alleged acts were in relation to criminal charges leveled against him in relation to the 1MDB case, the International Petroleum Investment Company case, and two cases of alleged abuse of power and money laundering under the MACC Act 2009. However, he said it did not involve charges in relation to SRC International Sundirian Berhad, a former 1MDB subsidiary that later became wholly owned by the Minister of Finance Incorporated. Najib also claimed, among other allegations, that the charges against him had long been planned by Thomas and the then Harapan government.